tackling the challenges of migrants arriving here in Chicago since last year. That's what two city council committees have on their agenda today. It is the first hearing of its kind since asylum seekers started arriving on buses mm -hmm. in Chicago last September. CBS 2's Asal Rizai live at City Hall ahead of the hearing this morning. Yeah, good morning, guys. The meeting will be virtual. Important to note there, and it is the first time these committees will discuss the status of these migrants and the housing costs and really what the plan will be, what to do with them in the future as far as more permanent housing goes. Now, we reported on the buses coming in from Texas and Colorado beginning back in September uh, to date over 5,000 people. Many of them migrants from Venezuela uh, have been sent here while many of them are currently at different shelters across the city. We've also reported on some that have ended up living in crowded police stations. That was just this week. They were transferred to a field house in Rogers Park, we're told, until they can be placed into shelters as well. Now, the city's council budget committee and immigrant and refugee rights committee now obviously prioritizing this issue, finally getting a chance to put this on the table. Now, the immigrant and refugee rights committee actually has not met since September of 2021. So a lot could be covered in this hearing this morning. That starts at 10 o'clock. I'm live from City Hall this morning. I saw reside CBS 2 News. All right, thank you so much. Meanwhile, state and community leaders are also hosting a meeting today about asylum seekers. It's set for 3 p.m. at the Rincon Family Services on North Kedzie. That's in Irving Park. They plan to update the community on how they can support families and also how they can coordinate efforts. There is a link to RSVP for anyone who wants to attend. We'll have that on our website, cbschicago.com. Chicago Police